hi this is sherry veronica if you have a photo of manila renee i would like to have a photo of that particular magistrate i think that anyone who is being paid by taxpayers their photograph all of their photographs should be online it, there should be a mechanism where you can find out what people who are being paid by taxpayers look like how old they are and certain things you may not need to know their address but you should know certain basic things about taxpayer funded people when you need to look for them especially if it's a job that is done that can you know put you in hotel st philip and those places you you need to be able to pull up those magistrates and the justices or whatever there should be a place online where you can find who they are but anyhow i was talking to patricia benedict and she said that when she was um in the magistrates court that someone who was not a prosecutor objected to her bail and in this case Dwayne O. Clark, Dwayne Omar Clark, in this particular case, it answers a question that I had. Let me go to it. Here, it says that this Dwayne Omar Clark, you know, when they said they're a businessman, what it means, but anyhow, you know, he's charged or whatever. But here it says that Clark could not plead to the indictable charges. Wait, wait, wait. Okay, but going down, going down, going down. Here it is. Magistrate Manila Rene on Friday and going down. Okay. With no objections from police constable Richard Ellis, he was granted $75,000 bail. But what I'm focusing on is a police constable objected or no objection. This In this particular Duane Omar Clark matter, this police constable richard ellis did not object to bail and when i was speaking to patricia she was saying that this person who is not a prosecutor objected to her bail and this kind of explains it. it this kind of explain it explains that you do not have to be a prosecutor anyone any police officer can be in court for a particular matter and object or have no objections to bail. That's why I'm doing this particular matter to explain that to people who may have that particular question. This is Shai Veronica, and don't forget to send me a photograph of Manila Renee. Shai Veronica.